What's up, family? Man, I bless each and every one of you that catch this video. And may God, Source Universe, continue to bless you, continue to guide you, and lead you into your broken development, lead you into healing and discovery of who you are and why you're here. I'm going in this morning, and this thing ain't gonna take us long to get there. You know what I mean? It's not gonna take long to get there, and it is what it is. This is a grown folk channel. We keep shit real here. I'm not gonna sugarcoat shit. I don't give a fuck about your feelings. I don't give a fuck about what you think in regards to growth and development. You have to grow up. You have to become accountable and responsible for your actions. You have to become accountable and responsible for the shit you entertain, the shit you think about. Okay? And for all you that want to chime in about why I talk the way I talk, I talk the way I talk because that's the way I want to talk. You know what I mean? I'm a grown ass man. I don't let anybody dictate shit to me on how I'm going to be. I live my life in connection with Source, the Most High. And I don't give two fucks what you or anybody else think about that. You, you know what I mean? We got to grow the fuck up. Stop trying to save people and save your motherfucking self. Stop trying to push religion down motherfuckers throat and deliver yourself from your self-righteousness. Deliver yourself from your toxic belief system. From the trauma and the pain you've been carrying your entire fucking life. But you so busy fixated and focused on trying to deliver and every and help everybody else. And it comes across as fucking self-righteousness. We gotta grow the fuck up. We have to grow the fuck up. People ask me all the time, man, and they say, man, I don't know how to let go. I don't know how to let go of the toxic shit that I hold on to. I don't know how to let go of the shit that my daddy did, the shit that my mama did, shit that my ex did, my baby daddy, my baby mama, and we do. We say all this stuff, and the truth is that's a motherfucking lie. You do know how to let go. Again, this is going to offend some of you, and this is going to trigger some of you, and this is going to piss some of you off. And again, I re you already know. I don't give a damn. <laughs> you know what I mean? I don't give a damn. I'm not here to be your best friend. I'm not here to be your homie. I'm here to shake shit up. I'm here to hold a fucking mirror up to you. So you can see you. For where you're at. So you can see the motherfucking truth. The truth is we know how to let go of shit. We just choose to let go of the wrong things. Catch that. So many women have talked to me. Man, I can't let go. Da, 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 and da, 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 da. and then there ain't no good men. And da, da, da. No, motherfucker. Don't, don't get it fucked up. You've had a good dude. You've had several good dudes approach you, but you didn't want them. They wasn't exciting enough for you. They were boring. They were nerds. They were squares. They were lame. You chose that knucklehead. You chose that street dude. You chose that thug. You chose that motherfucker that was toxic as fuck. And then when shit went bad, you blamed dudes. Instead of your fucking selection. You let go of a whole bunch of good shit that presented itself to you. You let go of a whole bunch of good opportunities. Because you chose the fucking streets. And now that you come to grow up a little bit and you realize that the fucking streets don't want your raggedy ass. The streets don't want your used up ass, washed up ass. Now you want to have a come to Jesus moment. Now you growing up and understand, damn, okay, well maybe Jethro wasn't so fucking bad. Maybe that nerd that was going to work all the fucking time, maybe he wasn't so fucking bad. Maybe that girl that was always reading and studying and staying at home, maybe she wasn't so bad after all. We got to grow the fuck up. All women ain't bad women. It's a whole lot of fucking tramps out there. Don't get the shit twisted. It's a whole lot of trash out there. Don't get the shit twisted on both sides, guys and women. 
trash every fucking where. Don't mean you have to pick that shit up. Don't mean you have to take that shit home. You just have to grow the fuck up and become more selective in your choosing. Why do you keep taking trash? Why do you keep taking trash home? Why do your dumb ass keep taking these fucking alley cats home? You keep taking fucking hood rats home and trying to wipe their ass. You keep taking these fucking lames home that, is, that don't mean you no fucking good. That wanna abuse you and fuck you and do everything else but take care of you, except provide for you, except love on you and nurture you and help you in your growth and development. They wanna smoke, drink, fuck, have, do all the wild shit. But don't wanna do anything to help you in your growth and development. But because that's not important to you, you keep picking these motherfuckers all they know how to do is turn up. You keep picking all these motherfuckers all they know how to do is get lit. And you keep letting go of all the good shit that come in your life. All the great opportunities that present themselves to you. For whatever reason, you let that go. But you keep holding on to these trashy ass people. You keep holding on to these people that no longer serve your greater good, that never served your greater good. The problem isn't that these people don't serve your greater good. The problem is you don't know what your fucking greater good is. The problem is you don't know you're not connected to your greater good. You're not connected to source the most high. To even understand, to be tapped into your greater good. So if you're not connected to source, the most high of the universe, to be tapped into your greater good, how the fuck are you going to know what your greater good is? So you're going to keep making dumb ass fucking decisions. You're going to keep holding on stupid ass shit that don't serve your greater good because you're not tapped into purpose. You're not tapped into your source to see what your purpose is. We got to grow the fuck up. We got to stop playing fucking games. We got to stop fucking lying to ourselves. We'll walk away from a job. We'll walk away from people and we'll cut people off that challenge us. People that be in our fucking grill and hold us accountable, we'll cut them off. We'll say they're toxic, we'll say they're narcissistic, we'll say all this bullshit to justify us cutting them off. Because they want to hold you fucking accountable. And you'll let go of them with no fucking problem. And you'll keep hanging on to that motherfucker, all they want to do is get lit. All they want to do is have their raggedy ass on the fucking streets. But the person that's trying to give you the best in life, the person that's trying to pull you up off that fucking dungeon you in, the person that's trying to show you you can have a better fucking life, you don't want them. You don't even want to be here around them. You'll cut them off. And you'll choose to stay in that toxic ass shit. Because they accept you for your toxic fucking behavior. They accept you for your raggedy ass fucking way of living. We gotta grow the fuck up. Just because somebody challenged you, just because somebody want to hold you a fucking accountable, don't mean they don't mean you any good. It don't mean that they're, they're a bad person. You, you know what I mean? We got to grow the fuck up. In this generation right here, right now, they don't want to be held fucking accountable. They want to wow the fuck out and do what the fuck they want to, but not be held accountable for their fucking choices and the decisions they made in life. You got women and guys the exact same way. 
make fucked up choices, but don't want to be accountable for them. Don't want to be responsible for leaving their wives. Don't want to be responsible for the choices that they made in choosing the wrong guy. Do what you do. Do what you do. Live life the way you want to live life. But if you come to me, you come to a real one and ask and start talking. We're going to keep shit real with you. And you ain't going to like it. Because the truth fucking hurts. The truth hurts when you don't want to be responsible. The truth hurts when you don't want to be accountable. Looking in the mirror is a painful fucking experience when you don't want to see what you want, what you need to see. I said again, looking in the motherfucking mirror is a painful experience when you don't want to see what's really there. We gotta grow the fuck up. We gotta stop playing these fucking bullshit games. Hope and pray that I said something to encourage you, to inspire you, to even challenge your way of thinking. We gotta grow up. I love you guys. Happy healthy. Peace.